First thing I want to tell you that it's okay. It is okay to get knocked off your path. It is okay to lose your way from time to time. But the thing about it is when you get knocked down, it's important that you don't stay down because you miss 100% of the shots that you do not take. Hear me when I say this. Understand that God has something special over your life. He will never put more on you than you can bear. And when picking out this journey and he was looking for a soldier, he chose you. Remember that. He could have picked anybody else to to go where you're going to go, to do all the things that he needs you to do, but he chose you. And that means that you are the soldier equipped to handle it. Understand me when I say this. The calling that's been put on your life was not a mistake. When God was handing out callings and he handed out these journeys, he picked you for a reason. And so if he has faith that you can accomplish what you're set out to accomplish, then you should have faith in yourself that you can do the same. The thing about it is, you can be the biggest peach in the bunch and there's gonna be somebody that does not like peaches. If the road to success was easy, then everybody would do it. There's gonna be late nights. There's gonna be friends that switch up on you. There's gonna be people that you thought that had your back that aren't going to have your back. But at the end of the day, everybody can't go where you're going. Remember that the next time that you want to quit, that you're special and you got this, you do. Sometimes you just need to take a moment and reflect on how far you've come. Because it's easy when you're like in the situation that you're in right now, it's, it can feel like this is just the biggest challenge ever. Your world is over. You just cannot find the will to keep going. Sometimes it's okay to look back to see how far you come because you've been here before. You face challenges, you face trials, you've been through tribulations, and you thought that it was over, and you made through it. You did that. When you was down and out, you're back against the wall, you didn't have nothing else to do, you kept going for you. You owe it to yourself to keep pushing forward. Think six months in the future where you would be if you don't stop today. Think six years in the future where you could be if you don't stop today. Make decisions today that future you can be thankful for. I know it's hard. I know it's hard to keep going, but you gotta keep going. You do. You owe that to yourself. You came into this world by yourself, and that's exactly how you gonna leave. It's alright to be scared. We all get scared. I'm scared. But fear kills more dreams than than failure ever will. You gonna be alright. I got faith in you. You gonna be alright. Listen to me when I say this. Look at where you came from. A year ago, six months ago, six years ago, at some point in your life, you were wishing to be where you are right now. Your hard work got you here. Them trials and them tribulations, been through that. Them heartbreaks, them backstabs, got through that. Your hard work, your dedication, your blood, sweat, and tears got you to exactly where you are right now. Think about quitting. You think that you just can't do this no more? Remember the reason you started. Remember the reason why you started this journey in the first place. And use that as your motivation to keep pushing. That feeling inside of you that made you get up and start this, whatever it is, that's why you gotta keep pushing. And even if you haven't started it yet, the fact that it's been on your mind this heavy the fact that you submitted this question, whatever you were thinking about when you sent this question in, whatever has got you nervous, whatever the reason, it's on your mind for a reason. So shoot for it. You miss 100% of the shots you do not take. So you need to sit back, you need to reflect. How bad do you want it? You got it. I believe in you. 